guys welcome back to my channel so today i am doing the highly highly requested updated bracelet collection i held off on this video for so long because like legit every single bracelet i have made since my last collection video you guys have legit seen it it's either been for like a tutorial or i made it into a tiktok or like i posted it on my instagram so like i just didn't feel the need to do this video because like you've already seen everything but like y'all wanted it so i was like okay let's just get right into the video so i have a huge pile of stuff here and i also have this box i've separated everything that i've made this year so far in a different box so i'm just gonna start pulling out bracelets and showing you guys first here i have these two anchor bracelets i did a rainbow one and then a blue gradient one i have two greek wave bracelets one that's orange and pink and then this one is navy blue and green it looks black but i promise it's navy blue I have three of these inverted chevrons. I absolutely love this pattern. This one has a little turtle charm and then this one has a little star. This is weird. I don't know, I made this pattern but I was really hating how it was looking so I kind of just stopped making it. And now it's this weird thing. <laughs> I have this bracelet. I called this the circle candy stripe. I really like it. I think it's super pretty. I have my beautiful sunflower bracelets. I absolutely love these. I have a crap ton of beaded zipper bracelets. This one's just a random pattern I found. It's like this diamond one. I really like how it turned out. I have some ladder bracelets. I literally love this design. It looks so pretty. I have this like distorted candy stripe moment. And then this like distorted chevron. This one's really pretty, I like it a lot. I have two rag rug bracelets. I have these two watermelon bracelets. And then these two watermelon bracelets. I used to have a video on this, but it got copyright claimed, so it's not on my page anymore. This one, I don't remember what I called it, but it's like uh, this diamond candy stripe. It's really pretty. I have this like XO kind of bracelet. I have these two bordered candy stripes. I have this plaid bracelet. I swear I had another one, but I literally cannot find it. So I just have this one for now, but I love this one. I have this cactus bracelet. This one's just like a chevron type deal, but like with little diamonds in the middle. This one I made when I went to Disneyland. It is a little Mickey Mouse head. I really like that one. It's really cute. I have this candy stripe. I absolutely love this candy stripe. I love the colors. I have this bracelet. I called this the triple single because we have a candy stripe, we have a chevron, and then we just have a solid color. And I like this one. This one's really cool. This one's a little zigzag with a little blue rhinestone charm. These are just these little simple zigzag bracelets. Then I have this little bee bracelet. It's so tiny, I don't even know. It's really ugly, I don't, I don't like that one. And then I have my seasonal bracelets. So I have this pumpkin one that I made for Halloween. I have this ghost one for Halloween as well. And then I have this candy corn bracelet for Halloween. For Thanksgiving, I just made this little turkey bracelet, which I think is kind of funny. And then for Christmas, I have first this snowflake bracelet. I love this one. I have the candy cane bracelet. This is a little Christmas tree bracelet. I literally love this. I have the Santa hat bracelet. I did a video on this one, but it also got copyright claimed, so it's off my channel now, but it's still really pretty. And then I also made some Christmas anklets. So I have this one that's like red and white with a little Santa. I have this blue one with a little snowflake charm. And then I have this green one with a Christmas tree. So these are the bracelets that I made last year. So now moving on to bracelets I made this year. First, we have the luxurious Starburst bracelet. I love this. It's just a little keychain. It is so beautiful. I love this design. I have this little scrunchie keychain that I made. It's a scrunchie, not a donut. Um, I really like it. I think it's really cute. I have this double alternating chevron bracelet. I think this is really unique. This one I made, I ran out of string, so it's like really short, but it's really cute. It's like this little arrow pattern. I really like it. This one I love. It's like a little diamond arrowhead type deal. It's so pretty. I love the colors I used. This one's just like a little baby keychain, but it's like a little diamond pattern. This one's really cute. These are my mini arrowhead bracelets. This one has like little lines and dots and stuff. I really like this one. 
this one I did for my random pattern challenge. It's like a zigzag dotted type thing. It's really cool. This one's a cool, I don't even know how to describe this. I just really like how it looks. This one's just a little diamond X kind of arrowhead pattern. I don't know. This is really cool though. This design is like a little X, X's and stuff. I don't know, but this is really pretty. This one is a cool like geometric thing I messed up right there, but I think this looks really cool. I have these two unicorn bracelets. I want to make a full rainbow, honestly, and I think I'm going to have to do that, but I love this design. This is just a little diamond pattern. I messed up right here. I did this white border twice, but whatever. This is a little butterfly bracelet that I made. I have my vertical wave bracelets. I used tie-dye thread to make these and they just remind me of summer. I literally love them. I think this one's probably my favorite. I have this little flower bracelet. This one's just like a little diamond one. I used hideous colors on this, but I was just testing out the pattern. This one's like a little star kind of like thing. I don't know, it's, it's weird. <laughs> Oop, I have another vertical wave bracelet. This one is really ugly. I have this, I called this the simple striped bracelet. It's a little candy stripe with like a diamond in the middle. I have my simple heart bracelet. I love this one. This one's so adorable. And then lastly, I have this one. I just made this one for my random pattern challenge. It's this cool diamond one. I like it a lot. That's everything that I made this year in here. And then also I have these two little projects that I made. This is a chapstick holder. So it just holds, oh my God. It just holds a little chapstick like that and it's a little keychain. I get a lot of requests to do a video on this, but I don't think I will ever make one of these ever again because it literally took so long. But this is a one-two pattern and it was 64 strings and I just made it. I did a bunch of rows until it was kind of the length of a chapstick. And I just tied a knot in the bottom and then I kind of folded it into a cylinder and then just stitched up the side with thread. And then this one is a little pouch I made. So this is an alpha pattern. It's just like 64, I think it was 64 base strings. I'm not quite sure, but yeah, I also get questions to do a video on this. I don't think I'll ever make one of these ever again either because it just took way too long, but I just made the alpha pattern super long, folded it in half, stitched the sides together, and then I just stitched a little zipper on it. It looks like that. And then I have a lot of unfinished bracelets here. I have these two tiny bee bracelets. I just kind of wasn't really feeling the design, so I kind of just stopped making them. This one is so pretty. It's like this um, half and half like arrowhead design, but the pattern just got too confusing. I kind of like lost my place. I just did not have the energy to deal with it, but I would love to make this one again. Just try it better. This one was a little Christmas tree. I was gonna do this Christmas tree instead of this Christmas tree, but these just looked like little mounds. And also my strings were like getting really short and I had to add more string, which made the bracelet like look all weird. And I just, I was not feeling it. I love this one. I just kind of stopped making it, but it's a little reindeer. It's so cute. I love this one. I should pick this back up again, but. This one is actually a really cool like diamondy design but I just wasn't liking how it was looking and I just kind of was bored. This one is a little mermaid one. I just, I was not feeling it. I didn't like how I did the triangle and it looks ugly. I just, I don't know, I just wasn't feeling her so I kind of stopped making that one. This one's like a kind of like distorted candy stripe thing and I again just like, it was a super wonky looking bracelet and the colors are just weird. This one I really like, so it's this like um, glitch design that I was going to make it say game over, but again, I kind of just got bored. At this time, I was like not into making alphas at all. This one I did once and then got bored. It's supposed to be like a little chocolate covered strawberry. This one's from really long ago, but it's a really cool like twisted zigzag design. But I guess my strings got really short and I just wasn't feeling it anymore. This one, I'm going to do a video on this. This is supposed to be a turtle. You literally cannot even tell. I don't know why, but like literally, 
this bracelet is so loose and like I don't even know but it's supposed to be a turtle so I'm gonna do a video on this soon I'm just not sure when but this one was this cool like diamond type deal but it just was looking kind of weird I just wasn't feeling her anymore this is one of my simple striped bracelets I got pretty far but I had other projects so I kind of just stopped making it this one is almost like a lotus flower type deal I again just like wasn't really feeling this one this is another B bracelet I made this one I had mono and I did pretty good and then I got kind of bored and was also just in a lot of pain so I stopped making it but it's really pretty still and then lastly this one is like a weird design it has like a bunch of like holes and stuff in it and like it was this like twisted zigzag type moment it has this little turtle charm on it but it just got confusing and I just like wasn't feeling it so I stopped making it all right guys so that was my collection video I actually forgot some stuff um I forgot this bracelet on my wrist it's this little like butterfly one and then I also have some on my keys so I have this butterfly one that I did a not with me video on and then I have this it's like a pixelated flower type deal so so that was my video I hope you guys liked it and I will see you guys in the next video bye